Do you feel blessed for the time that you had with Kelvin? Absolutely. I wrote in my journal last night that, you know, the tragedy isn't that she died. You know, we, we all must go the way that Kelvy went. The tragedy is probably in how she died and how old she was when she died. It's been roughly two days since 18-year-old Kelvy McCray was shot and killed in her West Palm Beach home. Police say her ex-boyfriend pulled the trigger. I never would have thought this could happen. Family spokesman Ricky Aiken, Kelvy's uncle, told me today the family is devastated and he will never get over the murder of his niece. Yeah, her boyfriend came in and shot at my baby dad. A frantic call to 911 Wednesday night from 18-year-old Calvi McRae's mom. West Palm Beach police say 19-year-old Keyshawn Shaw shot and killed his ex-girlfriend that night. Family told me Shaw snuck into the house when someone took out the trash. Shaw died Thursday afternoon at the hospital from a gunshot wound to the head. According to police, Shaw lived with McRae and was upset over the breakup. I believe that if there is a prevailing message through this experience is that we should be highlighting the need to protect our girls through making sure they know what to do if they find themselves in a situation like this. Aiken says the Inlet Grove graduate loved people and people loved her. He says there is strength to be gained through tragedy. I see the message in that, you know, because if that young man wanted to do anything, it was to bring a sense of devastation. And I think the not allow, allowing it to devastate us um, speaks volumes to who Kelby was as a person. In West Palm Beach, Todd Wilson, WPTV, News Channel 5.